welcome back to the channel and today we are continuing our crash lander survival journey uh trying to gather enough materials to build this thing um but the focus for this episode i think is going to be side quests because some comments have reminded me that i have uncompleted side quests and after i do this quest those side quests will be no longer available so i should probably do them so that i've actually you know experienced that part of the uh this mod here but we have also just gotten a whole bunch of materials so let's actually let's at least do one new stage of the well let's see if i have the materials necessary to do one new stage of construction on this thing and fill in pretty much almost exclusively uh polished metal block and then these these great these great things here it is oh yeah so we need two of them so we need 60 net block i think i already made 60 net block 20 polished metal blocks. So I just need a bunch of polished metal blocks. So beeswax. That it's not just the mining materials that was the problem. Beeswax is a problem. I thought I got more beeswax than I needed. Did I not get more beeswax than I needed? Please tell me I have some leftover beeswax. Oh, here we go. Some beeswax. Okay. All right. Polished metal block. Here we come. Okay. Well, now we got to wait for the polished metal block. How much do we get? We get 20 at a time. That's not bad, actually. So while that's crafting, I can probably craft one of those things now. Parts. Oh, it's it's also in this thing. Dang it. That means I got an extra weight. 30 metal or 30 net block or 60 net block. I think I probably put that in my block. There we go. 60. I am prepared. Partially prepared. All right. So then one, two. There we go. Dang. These use 20 polished metal block each. What do you think I'm made of? metal i can see how you'd be confused mine i do go by scrap man but it's not it's not not the right thing i do also have a metal music channel as well there's all right i understand i understand where the confusion came from i am associated with metal in multiple ways but i promise i'm not made of metal oh i need more metal all right let's get the smelter thing oh oh this will be easy here we go so we do this and then we do this, and then we do this. Oh, that's the output. I keep getting that confused. Where's the input? Oh, that's not where I was expecting. All right, so then we do this. Oh, I need an output chest. Although we'll do, uh, this is my chest that has all the materials. <gasps> this is not a vacuum chest. I need a vacuum chest. All right, well, I got two of those things anyway. Here, let's craft a little bit more of that. Um, vacuum chest. I don't think I have any of those left. I'll probably just make some more one oh no am i out of component kits i think my component kits were over here oh i'm almost out of component kits all right i'll just do this manually while i am also trying to process the chest so we can have an output uh to these things um glue i believe is over here there we go everything looks really disorganized but eventually you start to memorize your disorganization and then it becomes organization so now i need chest lid I need a metal uh, cage component. And then I need a large chest base component. There's too many, man. Too many things. Piston extension component? Oh, to make a piston. Of course, you can't just make a piston. You gotta have a piston base and a piston extension component. All right, now I can make another large chest. And then I can make, well, I guess I can make a basic large chest. And then we can get a large chest. How's our smelter doing? Oh, it's done. Yeah, now it's large chest time. And I guess I'll just transfer this contents over to the other chest. All right, we got it. Um, m -m 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 -uh. Here we go. Now we can put that there. And then I'll just take all of these materials. And then we put them all... I guess these are basic components that we don't actually craft. I don't know. All right, yeah, just, just put it. Just put the stuff in there. Oh, that's ore. There. Now I can have the wedges. All right, so now I can do this. All right, now we're just gonna craft a whole bunch of metal. Like a whole bunch of metal. Look at all that. All right, and then this is just an extra chest. All right, now I've got 220 polished metal block and I've got the, I've got the, what are they called? Staircase landings. I've got the staircase landings. Ready? Boop, boop. Oh yeah, progress. Oh, I need, let's worry about those things. It's actually kind of hard. To not, oh, hold on. I'm confused. All right, 
I'm just gonna build through those things and deal with those after I've finished this. I could just delete the blocks, but I need something to build off of first to make it easy like this. You see what I'm saying? And we can count. Wait, is that it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven of those thingies. I need screws. Do I have any leftover screws? I got four leftover screws. Oh, I want to take a look at this compact computer on a vehicle. Uh, some people were saying that this has a WASD converter. Might be worth checking out. All right, I got four screws. Wait, I didn't even... How many did I count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Why you gotta be an odd number like that? All right, I need seven of these and I can get ten just like that. Man, one screw to get ten of these blocks? Pretty good deal. All right, now I can do... Bloop, bloop. Bloop, 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 bloop. There we go. We have moved on to another phase of construction. You know what? I'm going to keep going a little bit just because we've got so much to do. All right. Um. Wow. This is a lot of stuff. I feel like, wow. Okay. This is, this is a lot of stuff. This is really, I'm a little overwhelmed. Wait, am I using the right? No, wait, concrete. Wait, what's concrete? Is the interior, oh, the interior is concrete. This one is concrete. All right, I have a little bit of concrete. Maybe pillars first? Let's do the pillars, how about that? All right, I've done all the pillars. And, oh, this thing is confusing. All right, I'm just gonna do the same thing I did last time. I'll delete the, oh, I did not do all the pillars. Wait, wait. Wait, what? Huh? Something, something's off. Wait, what? How is... How is the... Oh, oh, this is not... How, when did that happen? Oh, this is concrete. That confused me so much. Okay, hold on. So this goes there. What did I, what have I done? Oh, this is not attached either. Okay, clearly I've messed up somewhere, but I think we're back on track. All right, now we have a bunch of incorrect pieces. Let me get my concrete. How much concrete did I have? Uh, I put it over here, 118. That actually might be able to get us through this. I'm gonna definitely need another set of these. I'll just do two sets. Uh, okay, we need some more. Oh, beeswax. I'm out of beeswax. So this is gonna be my last thing here. Um, Let's see. I need to go up there so I get to use the ladder. I, I get to use the ladder. Like, there we go. I know how to use ladders. I've laddered before. All right. No way. I had the exact amount. Literally the exact amount needed. I am out and I've got no more of those left, but I filled them all in. So we can finish this stage as long as 118 concrete is enough for this right here, which it looks like it should be. Yeah. Definitely enough. All right, here's the last of it, and boop. Okay, there's a lot more concrete needed. We're gonna run out right now. There we go. Whoa, that's new. Okay, there's a lot. This is way more complicated than I was expecting. And what is all of this gonna be? Oh, concrete. Okay, we need a lot of concrete. Oh, hold on. I think it's time. It's time for time for water chest. I need. I need more vacuum stuff. Maybe this is why I do the side quests. Maybe I should just do the side quests first. I'm gonna do it though. I'm gonna make three more of these. One, two, three, because I really want this water chest thing. I'm out of component kits now. There is a way to craft them. I need to get corn and flour. I just need to load up on corn and flour. And by flour, I don't mean like cooking flour. Like it sounds like I need corn and flour, like I'm gonna cook something masterful, but no, I need flour pot, like flowers actual flowers, paint flowers. All right, so I got this empty chest, which is perfect because I want to convert it to Mr. Vacuum chest. There we go. And then vacuum, how, what does it take to make, make the vacuum pipes again? Interactive vacuum. Beeswax. Everything comes down to beeswax, doesn't it? All right, are we done? Are we all out? We're all out of raw metal block. All right, but we had, that did not give us as much metal as I was thinking it was going to give us. Okay. 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 I think I'm starting to understand how things could be automated. So this is essentially the workbench, but automated. The assembler is, and then this metal manufacturer is the metal bench, but automated. So then what you could essentially do is all of these chests I have, if I convert them all into vacuum chests. I could have all of the chests hooked up into one system 
where every material is linked to every other material and then also have those linked to every single version of these benches automated and then they will essentially have a source they they will have a input source of every single material i own so i won't have to keep searching and finding what i have and don't have they will know whether i have it as long as my materials are in a chest that is you know uh in the system the problem is then if i go and do my nomad stuff where i'm collecting stuff out there i think i gotta come back and then sort it in chests actually i don't really need to sort it in chests do i because it doesn't have to be sorted unless i need to like pull it out manually but these things will pull them out automatically what is this glow crawler this is new this is new enhanced drill glow crawler enhanced drill connect a chemical container and button it trigger an explosion at the tip what's a glow crawler and why does explosions have to do with them what is what is this uh is there anything else that i should be aware of all right you know what let's do some side quests how about that worry about the water later we need to do some side quests all right so i don't know if bill has any more side quests i think he might but let's just let's see what looks closer bill's house is over there here let's do a little bit of a okay yeah, that's not moving very much. Um, anyway, these things, all of this stuff I can now pretty much remove. I'm just gonna put this stuff into my inventory so it's not weighing down my vehicle. Oh, my inventory is... Is this new? There's been an update. Pick up. Can we not do this anymore? Can we not? No! I want to be able to bring it with me. Oh, no. You can't just delete these things into your inventory anymore. They have to be physical objects. All right, well, we don't need the refiner where we're going. I'm nervous about the glow thing. Glow crawler or whatever that is. Oh, I need chemicals for concrete. How do we make chemicals? Oh, yeah. Oh, corn and pigment flour for chemicals. Hold on. Was I mistaken about the... The thing. Oh, component kits are not corn and pigment flowers, but I do need corn and pigment flowers for chemicals, so I should pick that stuff up anyway. More beeswax. I need a lot of beeswax. The problem is, it seems really hard to come by. I think one of the side quests involves beeswax, though. I'm gonna go to... So, Bill's is that way, and HQ is that way. It looks like they're probably the same distance. What am I doing? Uh, let's just go to Bill's house. All right, and... Oh, I should refuel, shouldn't I? Yeah, let's refuel. Get to use our fueling station legitimately for the first time. All right, we just pull up. And... Boop. But now... If I want it to refill, I've got to... Reset this thing. And have it continue crafting. There we go. Okay, off to Bill's house we go. I'll also try to collect any, um... Beeswax. And other stuff other important things on the way i have chosen a very poor place to go to bill's house i i cannot get through here very, oh look at that. that was actually pretty epic oh my goodness i don't know where i am i don't know where i'm going apparently if you sleep on the bed you can sleep through the night oh i, I legitimately thought it was just not doing nothing okay well that's that's nice all right let's continue on you know what i'm realizing you should be able to make a beehive and then have your own uh, beeswax farm. That would be pretty cool. All right, we made it back to Bill's. It's been so long. Hey, Bill, how you been? I'm too busy right now. I can't help you. I'm sorry. Is there something I can do for you? Kill 10 glow bugs? What? All right. Ooh, 10 component kits. Kill 20 glow crawlers. What's a glow crawler? Where do I find a glow crawler? 256 concrete block. I do need concrete block. Kill 15 walks. I can do that. All right, let's do that one. Oh, we're going to have a lot of side quests. I feel like we're definitely going to have a lot of side quests. Oh, okay, we got some walk. I got some beeswax over there. All right. They're actually not the easiest thing to kill because if they get up, they run away and hitting them. Also... Makes them go away from you. I don't think I want the walk sticks. I'll collect them any. No, nope, my inventory's full. Okay. Well, I'm gonna just kill this thing and, uh, while I'm here and get the bee. Oh, I can't get the beeswax. 
Ah, okay. Well, dang it. Yeah. All right. Um, I'm going to put down this new... Uh, no, I'm not going to put down a new chest. All right, so beeswax. Look at all the stuff I got, though. All right, what's like a chest that's not super... All right, here we go. This is all this stuff now. There we go. Flowers and beeswax and all that. Um, polished metal block. Oh, all right. Actually, before I kill the next walk, uh, let me get some of that corn because I need... I only have 21 beeswax. But yeah, I need some sustenance. There was some cows right over here. All right. All right, here. You two work on this. Uh, you work on this. I am going to get some flour. All right, I'll take some of this back and feed it to you manually. All right, how are you guys doing over here? All right, good, good, good. Thank you for the sustenance. No! Mm -hmm. Oh, these things are rough. Go in the water. Go in the water. Yes. No! Go in the water. There we go. These things are hard to, uh, to, to kill. Like, they're too, they're too lightweight. They're too ragdolly. They need to not ragdoll as much. All right, I've killed two. There was a whole bunch near me, and now they're all gone. I don't think running them over with my vehicle counts, unfortunately. Oh, there's one over here. Uh. Eh. There we go. What are you going to do now? Dang, I wanted, like, to hit him down. Oh, my goodness. Come back here. Glow crawler. I'm still, like, wondering what that is. Maybe it's a mine thing. It sounds like it could be a mine thing. They seem to have also fixed the alternator glitching out, but uh, to my benefit, this thing is no longer going and generating overheated. Wait, it needs water now? Water times 20? That's not a thing that happened before. I don't have 20 water. That's a lot of water. How do you overheat it? Is that by letting it um, generate, over generate more than it has capacity for? This game got more complicated overnight because that's how updates work, huh? No, 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 no. Get him, get him, Wolf, get him. Man, only three cows so far. This is actually going to take like, <laughs> it's going to take a whole episode just to do this. I mean, at least they don't seem that hard to find. Unlike glow crawlers, which I've never seen. They sound small and slow though. Oh yeah, the beeswax. I never got the beeswax over here. Hello, cow. I have some food for you before you uh, die. Ooh. All right. Well, that was a good, good harvest there. There we go. Here's the strategy. All right. I found the strategy. I found the strategy. There it is. That's how you do it. All right. Good to know. Oh boy. We got cows that the wolves are kind of really harsh in my vibe. If you know what I mean? Oh, that, I don't think that counts if I do it that way. Oh, we're fine. This is fine. Does my vehicle float? I don't even know. All right, here, you go that way. And then I try to like, dang it. What is with the sky over there? It looks weird. All right, there's six. Dang it, I'm trying to use, look at these wolves. These wolves are just stalking us. Don't worry, it's me and you, cow battling. We're the ones battling, I mean. Not like we're in this together. We're still opponents. Alright, um, can I get out of here? Excuse me, guys. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Go as fast as I can. Thank you. Alright, 7 out of 15. We made some decent progress there. Ooh, more beeswax. Bills has the beeswax. Let me get the chest first, though. What's in it? Come on, kid. Useful. No! No, no, no! No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. No. No. I can't believe you've done this. What are my wheels? But more importantly, my torch. Do you have any idea? Like... I've only got 47 more of those, but I cannot believe what they took one of my wheels. I think fortunately I have some extra. Yeah, here we go. Large wheel right here. Okay. Don't do that again, guys. Cause, uh, I might not, I'm going to run out. All right. We got another cow right next to some corn. You know, you can just eat it probably directly from the thing. These ones are even bigger. All right. Here you go. Ah, whoa. Whoa, what is going on here, guys? Don't worry, cow. I got you. I'll defend you before I kill you. I got all this armor on. I don't even got, I didn't got to worry about the wolves anymore. Oh, this guy's playing super dodge attack. He's using, used agility. 
All right, go towards my vehicle. There we go. Yeah, that's the way to do it. Oh, more beeswax. Yes, a lot of these little beeswax nodes. All right, we got another cow up here too. And give you some more corn. All right, get over there. Oh, that way. Yeah, all right, nine out of 15. Ah, ah, <laughs> the cow fell. Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I made fun of you. Dang it. Oh, I only need two more cows and I think I've like, I think I've exhausted this area. I don't want to have to go too far away from Bills, just have to come back two kills later. But it looks like that's what I got to do. There's nothing around here. All right, we got one more left and there it is running towards the ocean. I'm sorry you couldn't make it, but I need you. I need you for the quest. I need you for concrete. Hey, Bill. Hey, Bill. Got something for you. I'm a monster. Wait, you did tell me to do that. You, well, oh, okay. 256. That should help out. All right. And then you've got, oh, kill four bears. Bring 50 broccoli. Okay. Yeah, I am not at that. I don't even, 25 component kits for that though. This, these quests are actually like a lot of, there's a lot to do just to get these quests done. Like that's like a whole new gameplay style. Like I don't even have a farm right now. Bring 50 broccoli. Do I even have broccoli seed wait what do you trade i can get broccoli seeds from them but i need bananas i don't have banana seeds okay i can get beeswax for oranges see i gotta do farming if i want other ways of getting beeswax i feel like it'd just be quicker just to uh just to go find beeswax all right i'm not a huge fan of his side quests that are left let's go check out hq because I feel like there's a beeswax reward. Well, actually, let me just deposit some of my beeswax. Oh, yeah, look at that. We're getting somewhere on the beeswax. There's still places to go, but we're getting somewhere. All right, two, four, Terra. All right, I have made it. I think I just killed a wolf under my vehicle. Um, but I haven't checked this chest, so there's definitely a chest here. Let's see what's in it. Hmm, ooh, component kit and a tomato. All right, let's head in and see what kind of quest people are up to or want me to be up to. All right, is somebody around? Somebody, anybody. I just want to see what kind of quest we got. Hello, Mark. Are you the one? Oh, 50 bees wax for eight logic gates and six timers. Dang. I don't have any of my crafting stuff with me. That's a problem. That's a lot of bees wax though. And also the large, I don't know what it takes to make a large explosive canister right now, but level four, two level five pistons, two level five center, uh, centers, and a level five thruster. That's actually like really valuable. Whether or not it's like super useful, but the value, like the amount of component kits that go into that is amazing. All right, this, I don't know what it takes to make timers. The logic gates are pretty simple. Let's let's do this. Actually, let me talk to him again. Uh, looks like the same ones. Let's talk to Ivan. Bring him three large automatic chests and he's gonna give me a bunch of vacuum stuff. Bring 10 glow poop and I get a bunch of vacuum stuff. Nine vacuum connector components. Glow poop is easy. 80 chemicals for 100 potato seeds. Eh, glow poop is pretty easy. There's water right near here. I don't have any crafting. I should have brought my crafting tables. Why did I leave them behind? Logic gates er, makes the most sense because I can't get glow poop without cardboard and I can't get cardboard without my crafting station. So we're going to do this one, bring eight logic gates and six timers because I had to go back to my base to get them. And I need the beeswax. That's like the main thing I want on my quest anyway. All right, now to go home, which is, oh boy, home is in that direction. That is the worst direction from Forterra. Oh my God, look at all the cows and bear. A lot of wildlife around here. What's a glow crawler though? How do I get up this cliff? I need to get in that direction. I'm just going around. I feel like I'm wasting a lot of time here. Ah! Someone's attacking my thing. Oh, it's a bear. It's a bear, it's a bear, it's a bear. Mm, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. There's everything around me. Mm. I hope he didn't damage you. Oh, he's climbing. Oh, oh, what? What do I do, what do I do, what do I do, what do I do? Where's my gun? Where's my gun, where's my gun? Oh, beeswax. There's beeswax. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. There's so much beeswax here. Everybody leave me alone. There's more important things than battle. Ah. Uh, 
Fine, fine. This is the worst place. I hate going through these forests and there was a bear as soon as I got into the forest. Ooh, there's so much beeswax in this area though. I got just like, I got so much beeswax. All right, the bear was hitting the back of my vehicle. Everything looks fine though. Oh, there's the bear. Uh, 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 it's so scary. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, if the wolf wasn't, if there's wolves every, what? There are wolves everywhere. What is this? What is this? Ah, there's like three wolves. Why is this the most dangerous place on planet scrap mechanic? I just want to get through here, but I can't go fast. Where'd they go? All right, looks like the coast is clear. I think I lost them. Whew. Okay. I don't know where they went, but they're not here. And that's all that matters. I can't, I can't fit through here. Ah, don't do that to me. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, okay, I'll fight you guys. You guys are just, you know, not bears. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. Whoa, oh my goodness. They, oh wait, whoa, how'd you do so much damage? Strength and numbers. How many? Dang. All right, let me out of here. Why was this place the deadliest place? How do I even get through here? Come on, out of the forest. Out of the forest. Are we out of the forest? Feels like it kind of, but there's still a lot of visual obstruction. No! Alright, my... My base is in the least... It's the, in the worst possible location from Forterra, the way that my map generated. It generated all of the giant cliffs right in the way. I wish I could just see a top-down... Like, just a top-down topography map of what... What I have to go around. Oh, there's another bear there. Yeah, what I have to go around to get home from Forterra is terrible. Oh no! I'm surrounded by more, I'm like, I'm in a cliff dead end. Oh! I just hit a bear with my car. And I'm running into a dead end. Don't worry, I don't think the bear's gonna keep up with this. Hit up the cliff. All right, almost, almost made it. Is the bear coming? All right, I can do this. I think I can do this. Sorry, I just do... Oh. Maybe I can't do this. This is the strategy. We get in. Uh, we lift ourselves up. Get our toilet seat. And then we do... Oh, I missed it! No! I gotta catch it after I put my lift down. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, all that to scale a cliff so I don't have to get, get I don't even know where I would have got one from there. Oh, no, I got to go through a big forest again. Unless I just go this way. Maybe I can go around it. Yeah, uh, this has been a nightmare of a journey. Going to Bill's house was not bad. Poor Terra, not good. All right, we finally made it back. So I now I have a bunch of beeswax. So that's good. And I have a bunch of concrete. Here, let's use the concrete that we got and fill in what we can now. All right, actually, before I do that, let's see what ingredients I need first for what I need to do. Interactive timer, component kits, a lot of component kits. I don't have a lot of circuit boards left either. What does it take to make large explosives? Slow poop, that's actually not too bad. So I need eight logic gates and six timers. So that means I need, I have one logic gate. Well, I'm gonna have to make, so, for eight logic gates, I need four component kits. For six timers, I need six component kits. Beeswax. Oh, what does it take to make these? Okay, I think I have the materials for this. <laughs> we got plenty of metal and we got plenty of copper. And we use that to make the uh, circuit boards and component kits. All right, let's just make a whole bunch of component kits right now. Okay, this might not be as bad as I was thinking. I'm so, I still have that vanilla mindset, the vanilla survival mindset where component kits are not a craftable resource and you can only like just find them. All right, well, a bunch of more circuit boards are crafting. Now let's start filling this in. This is nothing. I'm gonna use it all right now. There's all of the concrete. I'm out. All 256 gone in an instant, just like that. Can't believe it. All right, so I need eight. So one, two, three, four. They get two per craft. And then I'm going to need, I think I have what I need. Yeah, I got everything I need now. I need six timers. All right, and then while that's doing that, 
Do I have stuff to make more concrete? I need water. I wanted to make the water station. So for water station, I need the vacuum tube. For the vacuum tube, beeswax. Everything came down to beeswax. So plastic, I think I can make some plastic. I need chemical and oil. I definitely got oil, oil and chemical. Let's just make a bunch of plastic block. All right, these are still going. One, two, three. Oh, look at that. And then six timers. One, two, three, four, five. I need, oh, are you kidding me? I'm one circuit board short and then more circuit boards. Oh, my inventory is full. Oh, look at these chests. I got other chests in here. All right, I'll put that chest in there too. Oh, I got another large wheel. That's good as a backup. All right, I got to keep the beeswax on me. All right, I need one more timer. There we go. And then some more circuit boards. Let's just fill up the rest of circuit boards and vacuum tube, plastic block. I need that. There we go. And then we can add, oh, I need the circuit boards and then we can add the vacuum tube. All right, we're gonna put some some water extraction down by the pond. All right, now we can make the vacuum tube, perfect. And then I'm gonna need one of these L... No, I don't think I need one of these elbows. This is not gonna be an elegant looking thing. I'm just gonna put it in the water with a vacuum. So yeah, the chest that I put up here, this one is gonna be full of water. See, look, what is this? Glow crawler scute, like a scale or something. They're like metal scales. It reminds me of the cable bots or whatever they're called, like the cable snipping bots from the dev blog. So maybe they're an underground thing. I don't know. All right, we got the vacuum. We've got all, we've got all the materials for the quest too. Um, we got the vacuum and we got the chest. So I think that should be enough. So I'm just gonna drive straight down to the water, closest point. We don't want this to be any more of a trip than it has to be. So what I'm thinking, oh, I need a switch. But what I was thinking is we just do this and this, and I just need a way to turn it on. Do I have a, a switch on me? I don't think I do. That's fine. I'll just go make one. And I need a lot more, I'm gonna, what does it take to make the vacuum connectors? These oh, component kits. I just need a lot of vacuum uh, to, uh, chests. All right, so I need a switch. All right, um, I guess I'll put it on the vacuum pipe itself. Can I, I'm gonna build this. Let's use a material that, uh, I guess this actually is a pretty abundant material for me now. Build that into the ground so I could potentially disconnect that and reattach a new one if I wanna have an extra one and swap them out. So I will put the switch on it, on the tube itself. Wow, it's so fast. What did I need 20 water for? <gasps> My alternator. Well, look at this. I got 20 water. What do I do with it? All right, alternator. I got 20 water for you. Overheated requires water 20. How do I give it? How do I give it 20 water? Wait a minute. Is it what I think? Hold on. Do I got to like, do I got to pour water on it 20 times? That requires water times 20. It's not working. It's raining. Can that help? I don't know. I'm not understanding. I'm not understanding the water thing for the alternator. Oh, the alternator has an input port that is not very accessible. Is this a new thing for alternators? That they need water to, uh, to not overheat, like a constant source of water? Is this already full? Holy cow, it's already full. I kind of feel like I'll just bring it with me. I feel like I kind of have to. All right, well, I'm gonna take it. I guess I'll just, I could just, this is such an easy system. I might as well just carry it instead of just having it live there. All right, I don't even remember why I was getting water. I know for concrete, but I feel like there was something else. Wait, when did you guys get in the desert? You guys aren't supposed to, there's nobody in the desert. Oh yeah, let me check out the, uh, the compute, the compact computer. Let me see how this thing works. Finally, put it right there. Power converter. Next mode. WASD converter. I don't know how that how it works though. Steering converter. I don't know how any of this stuff works. Toggle. Sit detector. Angle converter. Piston controller. Power converter. Use. Detect. Computer. Detected WASD. Oh. I need one per control. So if I want this to be a WASD converter, I need one for W, one for A. So it'll basically replace these buttons. 
instead of being one, two, three, four, it'll just be W A S D. So what does it take to make one of those? Let me, let's just try this. The logic gates I crafted is what it takes. So I need three more. One, two, three. All right. So for logic gates, I need two more logic gates, which means I need another component kit. I mean, uh, not component kit, a uh, circuit board. Sorry, circuit boards actually aren't that hard to make. There we go. All right, combat computers, I got them now. So I can delete these buttons, essentially. I'll just go, same thing. Forward, back, left, right. So, oh, computer power output setting. We're on the wrong thing. Next mode. Oh, I wanna see what the other modes look like. Steering converter. Let you change steering movements angle. It has to be activated. Yeah, that's interesting. I don't quite understand how that works. Toggle, okay. Sit detector. So wait, hold on. Let me go to sit detector. It looks like there's an LED on it. If I sit down, if it's attached to the seat, and I sit, hmm, I don't see any, I don't see anything light up. Angle converter, piston controller. Well, I'm gonna use WASD converter, obviously. So this one will be S. This will be A. This will be D. So now W S A and D. Now let's see if this works. W. It's not working. Only W. Oh, the, the rest aren't hooked up to the seat. That's why. All right. W, S, A, D. Figured it out. They're actually, that's actually pretty cool. They're not super expensive to make. There's some big waterfalls happening over there. You see that? Yeah, not super expensive to make but not bad. It's good being WASD instead of having to use my buttons. All right, how many logic gates do I have? I have six and I need eight. So I need to make two more logic gates. Actually, let's make a bunch of cardboard. Let's let's get, how much glow did I need? 10 glow poop maybe? What does it take to make cardboard? Scrap wood. I think I have scrap wood. Oh, not a lot of scrap wood. Not enough to make cardboard really. Oh, let me get my corn and flour to make some chemicals because then we can make a whole bunch of concrete oh that eats it up quick this is actually not going to be a lot all right i've made all of the chemicals i can now i just need some of that scrap stone which oh i have a whole bunch of that and yeah now we can just oh look i have so much scrap stone block we can craft a lot because like water we can craft this until i run out of chemicals basically do i have more chemicals I have six more chemicals in here. I think that's all my chemical though. All right, so let me get some more water out of the water chest. Yeah, we'll be able to craft uh, 30 more sets of 25 concrete with what we got right now. So all this concrete, I gotta figure out what that thing is right there. Okay, circuit board and 20 polished metal. Do I have 20 polished metal? I have 18, are you kidding me? Blocks, polished metal, look at that. That's what the beeswax is for. Beeswax, the world runs on beeswax. This world runs on beeswax. And then those circuit boards that I literally just put back, now we can make that thing. All right, and the rest is concrete. Let's get this concrete going. Actually, it's a lot of concrete though. Yeah, this is gonna eat through it super quick. Oh, this thing. There's like metal girder piece. Okay, what does that take? Here it is. <laughs> Polished metal block, who would have known? I need 40. All right, there we go, no problem. Large support, I think that's it, I hope that's it. Let's check on our concrete over here. All right, got a whole bunch more concrete now. This concrete is gonna go so fast. I don't even know if I have enough right now. I don't know if I, I, don't know if I have enough chemicals. All right, can I put that thing in? Looks like I can, like that. Good enough, looks like it. All right, this is built now. Let's put this one in. I hope this isn't supposed to have like a door. I'm like locking myself out. Is that right? Yeah, it looks right. There's the door. No, that's the battery. Oh, that's a battery thing. How am I supposed to get in there? After I block it all up? Or is it going to be exposed from the top? Oh, it's exposed from the top. Then if I fall in, then how do I get out? Like that's a battery thing. I'll like actually be stuck in here. There's no stairs. All right, I got more concrete anyway. Here, let's fill that in. Fill that in. We're making some good progress here. I actually might almost be done with the concrete. Oh, is this it? For the concrete? All right, there we go. And we just got this thing, which is a lot of, a lot of that stuff. Do I have any pipe pieces left? I might have some more pipe pieces left. I'm gonna stop making concrete because I feel like we don't need much more. Oh, I have exactly two. Exactly what I need. There we go. All right, man, we're gonna need like these cable pieces, like a power box piece, like whatever, this control station thing. We're gonna need a lot, but I think it's time. I think it's time to take a break. So we've done a lot without doing a lot, I feel like in this episode. Like we did a lot of things 
but didn't make a whole lot of progress. But at least now we know that beeswax runs the world. These are WASD converters. Can be pretty, pretty nice, pretty useful. I like that. And um, we now got a lot of water for water needs. I got it. Like you guys, let me know how. Oh, never mind. I do know. I think I do know. I have to figure out how to uh, get the water into this. But I'll figure that out another time. Is it as simple as just hooking, hooking it up to the chest? You make sure you guys are subscribed so you don't miss future episodes. We will be starting off the next episode. Don't worry, I didn't forget. I have completed the quest, but it's quite a journey back there. And I don't have time to go all the way back to Forterra and turn in the quest. But that's how we're going to be starting the next episode. And then we'll have enough beeswax to probably take over the world. So make sure you subscribe for taking over the world next time. Also got to figure out what a glow crawler is. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed the episode, you'll enjoy some more that you can find right here on the end screen. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.